I said, uh, what I want to talk about is how to go to heaven when you die. Amen? Yeah. Now, there are just a few basic things that we must understand about Jesus and the gospel to go to heaven. And the first thing that we must understand is the Bible says, as it is written, there is none righteous, no, not one. So, And the reason that nobody's perfect, the Bible says, For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. Right. For example, I have told a lie before. Have you lied before? Yes. Right. Everybody's lied, right? So nobody's perfect, everybody's a sinner. God loves us, but God is a righteous God. So there is a punishment for our sins. And Mauniang Gilima Ang Malita first. Okay, are you ready for the bad news? Yes. Okay. Bad news is very scary. The Bible says for the wages of sin is death. So because we've sinned, we're going to die someday. And the Bible talks about two deaths. There's a physical death of your body, and there's a second death when your soul goes to hell. Okay? In the Philippines, people say walleye forever. Okay? You say that if your Uyah breaks up with you? <laughs> That's not in the Bible, okay? The Bible says in Pierno is forever. Okay, wildlife purgatorio. Who's still got a couple of to say in Pierno? No! But this is the bad news. Because we've sinned, by Pierno, by Katala. The wages of sin is death. Okay, that's the bad news. Are you ready for the good news? Yes! God loves you, God does not want you to go to hell. So the Bible says, for the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Jesus is Jesus. Who is Jesus? Son of God. You know who? Savior. Right? Who is Jesus? 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 And that is very important to understand. The Bible says there are many false gods and there are many false Jesuses, but the real Jesus, he is God. Amen? Amen. Right. Now, Jesus showed many signs and many miracles to prove that he was the Messiah. But the most significant thing that Jesus did, Jesus never sinned. He never lied. He never murdered. He never stole. Jesus is perfect because Jesus is God. Amen? Amen. Now, what happened to Jesus? How did he die? Did he get cancer? No. Did he have a heart attack? The Bible says on the cross, Angamahan in heaven took the sins, Mangasala, the Kalikutan, and placed them on Jesus. All of my sins, all of your sins, the sins of the past, the present, and even the future, they were all placed on Jesus. And because he died with our sins, Angalati Jesus in Pierno, in our place, for three days and three nights. I'm sure you're familiar with after his crucifixion, they buried him in a tomb, right? His body. So while his body was in the tomb, his soul went to hell to pay for our sins. But what happened after three days and three nights? Did he stay in hell? He rose from the dead. Amen? Amen. He showed the nails in his hands. He showed his bleeding side. And then he walked on this earth for 40 days and 40 nights. 
But even though Jesus did that, halos tanan tao muat to sa inyero. Okay, most people they go to hell. But sa yung kaayo makaatu sa lahat. It's very easy to go to heaven. Um, let's read this this verse right here. It says, "For by grace are ye saved through faith, and that not of yourselves; it is the gift of God, not of works, that any man show." So ye have all are saved of the wasan from the inferno through what? Faith. Now, very important to understand. Faith in Jesus does not mean that you just believe that He's real. Faith in Jesus means paksalik kaidis. It means that you trust in Jesus. Is that done? Yes. Because almost everybody believes Jesus is real, right? But faith in Jesus means you trust in Him. Paksalik kaidis. But supagi sa pagtuo kaidis is sometimes works like bimuhata, right? Ang kawasan hindi pinagi sa binuhata. Ang kawasan na the first. Na binuhata maayo, si mga maayo, bakit mo maayo, pagiuso sa mga salam maayo. Pero hindi ka na ang kawasan. Ang kawasan patulikay Jesus. You see, there's two things you can be trusting in to go to heaven. You can either be trusting in your own works, your own binuhata, or you can trust in uh, Jesus. But, Okay. And once again, those works that would correlate with a, a, a false religion as well. Okay, but salvation is by Jesus. Do you know John three sixteen? For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in Him should not perish but have everlasting life. So if you want to go to heaven, there's only one thing that you must do. You don't have to go to my church. Uh, you don't have to go to any church, actually. You don't have to be baptized. You don't have to repent of all your sins. You don't have to be a good person. The only thing that you have to do to go to heaven, Amen? Now this is the really good news. Are you ready for the really good news? Yes. Alright. Kaluwasan gagamitin ko sa kalitili kinitaas ng proseso. Sabihan na luwas ka, luwas na kasalang tutunod. Si Jesus nagbayad sa tanan. Si Jesus nagbayad sa atong mga sala sa una, karong, sa una ato. So, hindi mawala ang kaluwasan. Once you are saved, once you have believed in Jesus, your soul is saved forever, and you can never go to hell. You can never lose your salvation. And I am not saying that you should do bad things. Okay, I'm not saying to skip church. I'm not saying to break the commandments. I'm not saying to commit murder or do drugs or commit suicide. But what I am saying, Jesus nakaya sa kanan, so hindi mawala ang kaluwasan. Isang kamuli ng magasimba, isang kamuli ng pagpapakismo, isang kamuli ng pag-inuso sa mga sala. You go to heaven if pagtulikay Jesus, right? However, if you have faith in Jesus and you're doing bad things, masukwan Dios. He's going to punish you in this life. If you commit murder, my preso, di ba? Right. If you do mga droga, God might send you care sa yung balay. Right? If you do drugs, okay, you might come to your house. If you drink alcohol, you're going to mess up your life. But you'll still go to heaven if you're trusting in Jesus. Does that make sense? Amen? Amen. A couple of times, it's regalo. It's a gift. If I gave her my Bible regalo, did she pay for it, or did I pay for it? You see, you buy us a new discount. I paid for it, right? So for her, I'm going to be a libre. She doesn't have to pay for it. She doesn't have to buy it. She does not have to work for it. It's free. Akalwasan. You see, you buy us a kalwasan. Kamu osiyusus. Right? Jesus paid for salvation. So that means you don't have to pay for it. You don't have to buy it. You don't have to earn it. You don't have to work for it. It's Libre. All you have to do is accept it by faith. 
Amen? Amen. And then once you've done that, you're saved forever. You can never go to hell. You can never lose your salvation. Amen? Amen. Now this verse right here is how I know that I'm going to heaven. And you can know that you're going to heaven. The Bible says, These things have I written unto you that believe on the name of the Son of God, that ye may know that ye have eternal life, and that ye may believe on the name of the Son of God. So the Bible says if you believe in Jesus, and not said Dios, ye or you, not said ye, but kamu, kamu, the Messiah, kamu, ye kamu, may know that you have Life. That's not that, no? Yes. Right? I know my name. My name is Richard. I'm sure you know your name. Right? Yes. So as sure as you can know your name, you can know that you're going to heaven if you do one thing. All you have to do is one thing to go to heaven. Trust. These words mean the same thing. Faith, believe, trust, paksale, paktu. Right? Let me ask it this way. Ang bautismo, bakit mo was niyo? Ang bautismo, bakit mo was niyo? O paktu. Ang pagsimba, bakit mo was niyo? O paktu ng kay Jesus. Ang pagimuso sa mga salab, bakit mo was niyo? O paktu ng kay Jesus. Important as well, and I'm not trying to offend anyone. But what is the name that you have to believe in? Who's that young Pangalan? Jesus, right? Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. And what that means is, Jesus, Laman, and Galante, and I can't take you to heaven. My church can't take you to heaven. Another God cannot take you to heaven. Another, you know, nothing can take you to heaven except for Jesus. Not Buddha, Allah, Muhammad, Mary, Pope Francis. Jesus said, I am the way. Amen? Amen. Now, once you believe in Jesus, how long does he save you for? Is it for our you? Because he's a man. Because he's a man. Because he's a man. Because he's a man. So what if... What if she believes in Jesus? And then she dies. But, yeah. What if, okay, this is a more extreme scenario. But, yeah. Do you think Jesus forgot to pay for some sins? No, he paid for all of them, right? Once you're saved, you're always saved. Okay? Now this is the hardest question. Are you ready? Amen. 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 She gets saved forever. When you have five years later, it's the hardest question, right? Today, she believes in Jesus. She trusts in Jesus. And then five years later, she has some doubts. But she already got saved today forever. Will she go to Lucky? She'll go to heaven because she already got saved. Ever and ever. Amen? Amen. So, all that All you have to do is get saved one time. Amen? Amen. Okay. So, Balita. Nasata Balita. Si Jesus. Do you understand that? Right? That's why you need to be saved because we deserve hell. That's why we need to trust in Jesus. Amen? Amen. Do you believe that Jesus is God? Yes. Do you believe he died for your sins? Yes. 
Do you believe in a bond house yet? Yes. Right. Now, are you going to be honest with me? Honesty is the best policy, right? Yes. Right. Before I came in here, okay, I think this is what you were trusting in. You don't have that. Is that what you thought? You probably thought you had to be a good person and go to church and do all these things to go to heaven. But the Bible says, not of words, And this is very important. Okay, are you listening? Yeah. I'm going to say this in English, alright? If you have just a little bit of faith in Jesus and a little bit of faith in baptism, you'll go to hell. If you have Gamai Patu Kai Jesus or Gamai Patu Kai Musus Amangasama, you'll go to hell. Because that means you're trusting in yourself. Okay, I'm Kalawasan Kaman Patu Kai Jesus. Amen? Amen. And that's why Jesus said, straight is the gate and narrow is the way which leadeth unto life, and you there be that find it. Almost everyone in the world, this is how they're trying to get to heaven, by their own good works, okay? But the Bible says, salvation, Amen? Amen? Now, last thing. Do you believe this? Do you believe this? Now, if you believe this, how do you tell Jesus that you believe this? Not about cell phone on deals. Not about Facebook Messenger on deals. Not about walkie talkie on deals. How do you tell Jesus what you believe in your heart? You pray, right? So listen, I'm going to say a prayer to Jesus. And if you believe this right now and you want to go to heaven, you can repeat after me and we're going to pray to Jesus and tell him that you believe the gospel. Amen? Do you understand? Yes. All right. So if you believe this, just repeat after me. Uh, dear Jesus, I know I'm a sinner. I know I'm a sinner. I know I deserve hell. I know I deserve hell. But I believe. I believe. You died for all my sins. You died for all my sins. And rose from the dead. And rose from the dead. Please save me. Please save me. Right now. Right now. Forever. Forever. Amen. Amen. Did you believe that? Yes. Where will you go when you die? You are not know you're lucky. Lucky. 50% sure or 100% sure? I did not Right? Do you believe that? Yes. But how can I Jesus? Yes. Jesus said, Whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. Amen? Amen. Now, just before I go here, Now, this is my church. If you ever want to come, you do not have to come to my church to go to heaven, right? But this is my church in Ecoland, Pillar Baptist Church, Navao. This is also a Facebook page and a YouTube channel. You can watch our sermons online, all right? But after you're saved, you know, you're saved by faith. After you're saved, be on that time You know, see on that time God wants you to go to church. God wants you to read the Bible. God wants you to pray. And God wants you to preach the gospel, okay? And it's very important that you do these things. Because if we don't preach the gospel to other people, they're, we're going to go to hell, right? Because before I came, this is what you thought it took to go to heaven. This is probably what your friends think it takes to go to heaven. This is probably what your family thinks it takes to go to heaven. So it's important to Ayo uh, that you preach the gospel to them. Amen? Amen. Right? But that's not something I can make you do. That's not something I can force you to do. That's something that you need to do if you care about me. Amen? Amen. All right, you're going to heaven regardless if you believe this today. Did anyone have any questions right now? No. All right. Well, salama sa now. God bless you all. All right. Thank you for your time.
Could everyone understand me? Yes. 